We received the call for this incident at 5.08 this morning. Uh, on arrival, crews encountered uh, intense flame, heavy smoke uh, from the building on Sutherland. It was a defensive operation, which means that our crews were not going into the building. It was um, too intense at that point. Uh, and what we're faced with now is what is essentially a city block that's on fire. There have been a number of explosions that I've heard. Uh, we have information that there were propane tanks in the building, uh, so that's likely what the cause is there. There are a number of vehicles, there's tire storage, there's propane canisters, so it is a significant fire load inside those buildings. The building is basically broken up into a number of sections, but the fire has spread throughout those buildings. One of the sections is what we would call ordinary construction, which is like brick. That section of the wall collapsed outwards early this morning uh, as a result of the fire condition. Let's talk about the smoke a little bit. There are concerns, there's residents, there's people that live nearby. So what concerns do you have about what's in that smoke? So all smoke is toxic. We are monitoring uh, wind direction and wind speeds. There were some embers that were blowing onto residential homes earlier this morning. Uh, firefighters were able to protect those homes and inform those residents. We did send out messaging to residents in the area to keep their windows and doors closed, in particular for individuals who may have respiratory conditions that could be aggravated by the smoke.